Hi guys, welcome back to episode 4 of the Road to Retain vlog. So this week saw our fourth league game of the season, away to Pema Maur. Now Pema Maur are current league champions, so it's always going to be a difficult game. Now on the night, the match went 1-0, 1-1, 2-1, 2-2. So everything was riding on this last frame, which had to be made, didn't it? So no pressure, let's jump straight into it. So apologies for the video being out of focus. Now, Pat plays off a handicap of 15, so I had to give him a five head start. <laughs> now he broke a couple of safety exchanges here this was actually a very good reply left me in a spot of bother here so try to go around the angles completely mess it up kiss the black and leave him on so from here Pat makes a nice little break actually put some nice balls Makes a break of 18. Surprising miss there. So I've got a little chance here now to get back into the frame. So he's currently 23 points up. I was feeling good in the balls. I thought this was a good opportunity to score. Missed the cannon into the pack there, just hit it a bit too hard and caught that red. So he needs a good recovery. And I thought, right, blue into the pack, open them up. On for a decent break here. Just missed the blue. So 17 break, so I'm only six behind by now. Pat pots are red and... Tucks me up behind the black. Now what I try and do here is leave him behind the brown to try and cut off the left side of the table. Play it really well actually. He's only got this red on the right hand side to go for. So he's left me a chance here. Balls are nicely spread. No, I can't believe I missed that. I think I was on 22. Missed a simple city like that. I was quite fortunate not to leave him anything. Plays a nice safety here. Completely miss it. Playing thin there and miss the red and hit the black on the way. With the seven away, I'm about 15 ahead. Thank you. 
Pat Potter's some great long balls, to be fair to him. I thought he was going to sink that blue, the way he's been potting. So at this point, I think I'm about five ahead. And I'm looking to get the white behind the black here. Now, Pat was unlucky there as well. He played a good shot. Thankfully, he left me on. Now, at this point, I'm thinking I've got a chance here. Screw back off the green. Just didn't get into it quite enough, but a tricky red. But if I can drop this in, the white's naturally coming up the table. Now here, I'm thinking, stun the black. Looking there at the yellow, it's frame over because the balls are just all lined up. And I just screw it too much. Bit of a miscue there, lucky to get away with that. Pat plays a great safety there. Extra roll and he's got me snookered. I'll play a good return, tap on the table. Again, an extra roll and he's got me snookered. So I try and do the same, just roll behind the blue here. Hit it a little bit too hard. Leave him a chance here. A bit of a thin cut, but... Good pot. So at this point, I think I only need the green to win. He gets an outrageous fluke on the green. And he sticks the brown up, so it's brown and blue for the match. Just trickle this one in. Leaves him needing a snooker. All in all, a great match. A couple of nice little breaks from both of us. Good potting, good safety. So there we are, four games in, four games won. If you enjoyed this video, please click that like button. And if you haven't done so already, please subscribe. Thanks for watching, and I'll see you on the next one.